what's up guys ifan back again with another video and this time we will be looking at how to use the v lookup in a slightly different way from what we had done in the previous uh, video supposing the scenario is that you've got you know you're working for an accounting company that does uh, taxes for your clients and the tax bracket the percentage of tax that the client is going to pay would depend upon his or her annual income now uh we've got some i've got some um, sample tax brackets set up over here uh so if the income is less than 20000 the tax is 10 10% it's just arbitrary numbers uh if the income is from 20 to 30 uh, more more than or equal to 20000 or le but less than 30000 the tax is going to be 15% between 30 and 40 is going to be 20% 40 and 50 is going to be 25% and 15 and above is going to be 30%. Now, you may have a, a, a you know a number of uh, uh, clients for who you you for whom you do your tax uh, the taxes. Now, it would be very tiresome and uh, prone to error if you were to try and figure out the tax bracket that each uh, uh, client would fall under. So, here's where we are going to use the wheel lookup uh, function of Excel. in a slightly different way than uh, what we had discussed in the previous video and if you remember in the previous video we had said that uh, we we would be looking at an exact match so we were doing uh, the 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 parameter that we were using false this time we're going to be using the parameter true to find the uh, the closest match so let me show, uh, uh, show you how it should be done say for example the client's in, uh, client makes $15000 a year now You need to figure out what his or her tax bracket would be. Now, looking at this table here, you can see it's less than twenty thousand. So the person would be paying ten percent tax. But you don't want to be doing this manually. So let's see how we would be doing this. How we would automate this. So again, we will say we look up, and we are going to be looking up the uh, the client's income, and this is the table that we will uh, looking it uh, up from. comma two comma and this time we will put a, a true instead of false to do an exact match we'll do the uh, the closest match and hit enter now you see 15000 is less than 20000 so his tax bracket is 10% now we can have multiple uh, customers with multiple uh, incomes so let's see how we would uh, uh, do this say for example we got another uh, gentleman who makes uh, another client that's not a gentleman that's another client that makes 17500 then you've got somebody making 20000 and 22500 then 25000 27500 uh, 30000 and so on and so forth now uh We, we we what we're going to do is we're going to use the same formula down here. So, but I what I want to do is since this is referring to this table, I want to lock these two uh, so they don't change. And if you remember, the way you lock this is put the uh, the dollar sign. So we put the dollar sign here. So every time, no matter what uh, this row is, the the V lookup will always go from G three to H seven. So now what we can do is we can pull this down. And you see, fifteen uh, thousand less than twenty thousand, so ten percent tax. Seventeen thousand five hundred, again less than twenty thousand, ten percent tax. Twenty thousand. Now you've hit this threshold. So now all of a sudden the tax has gone up to fifteen percent. Twenty-two thousand five hundred, again less than thirty. Twenty-five thousand less than thirty. As soon as you hit thirty thousand, the bracket changes. So this is uh, a quick way to uh, uh, figure out the tax brackets, and using VLOOKUP. And just remember, instead of using FALSE, you'll use the uh, the TRUE option. And the second thing uh, to always remember is, uh, in the VLOOKUP, when you're doing FALSE, you're doing exact match. Uh, this table from which you're looking up does not need to be in any order. Uh, when you're doing TRUE, it needs to be sorted uh, in ascending order. always remember that in in true it needs to be sorted in ascending order and that will give you the closest the, the first uh, closest match 
So uh, this is how you would uh, uh, use VLOOKUP to find out which bracket uh, a client falls under. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more videos like this, please subscribe. Thank you.